In September of 2007, uh, our youngest daughter, Jessica, at age 30, was diagnosed with late-stage melanoma. Approximately 11 years ago, my mother, who's the mother of eight children, Jerry Creshawn, was diagnosed with melanoma. As a third stage melanoma cancer survivor, I know the protocol of treatment. I understand the road and the journey that one has to take, and I want to help and pay that way for other people. So the progress that we have made uh, with the uh, donations coming into the immunotherapy fund have allowed us to uh, ask some important questions in the field and try and address them with uh, running studies here. We've made significant progress in terms of identifying ways to educate our young people to try and avoid sun exposure. We've been able to expand our laboratory presence. We've been able to identify those people that might be better served by having immunotherapy treatments. I think it's important to understand that uh, immunotherapy uh, has um, uh, improved and changed the overall outcome for melanoma, uh, whereas uh, the median survival used to be six to nine months. Uh, we now, with immunotherapy, have uh, uh, almost 70% uh, of the people alive with advanced disease uh, at three years, and this is just the preliminary data. I just wanted to say that we are very um, proud to be part of the immunotherapy program here at Levine, and all of the money that, that we have been able to raise has helped increase the resources that the doctors have, and, and in the last eight years, the changes have been tremendous, and I really wish that our family would have been able to be part of those things. I think our outcome would have been different. Basically, we want to support Carolina's health care in any way we can. Dr. Richard White, who we've known for years, when we talked to him, my dad and I looked at each other and said, this is the cause. This is what we need to do. The LCI expansion is really emblematic of where we're going in the future. We're going to see a substantial increase in the square footage that we can put towards the care of people with melanoma and other cutaneous malignancies. We're building in uh, our dermatologists. We're building in additional medical oncology personnel. We're expanding our ability to take care of squamous cell cancers and basal cell cancers. We're expanding our relationship with our laboratory efforts. So all in all, it's going to be a huge step forward. But what really is significant is being able to see the fruits of our effort uh, and how it helps with those people that are afflicted and touched by melanoma in our local community. It's just very important for us to be part of anything that has to do with melanoma so we can help other families that won't be in the same situation that our family was in. The one thing that my mom said was, people need to get their skin checked so that they can save their life. And that's our mission. The care provided by us can only go forward with the support from people like you.